You boys like Mexico? Whoa. Whoa. How the hell? Where the hell? Oh my god. This don't look anything like the POS bunker. The POS bunker is what they should call it. I never seen a gun like this before. They're strewn all over the place. Oh, it looks like something bad happened up here, friends. I do not want to be up here any longer than I have to. Where do you think this goes? The Capital Wastelands. Huh. Well, I guess it's better than staying up here wherever the hell I am. Oh, that little girl's coming. All right. Oh, ho, ho! Welcome. Now where the hell? Megaton. Megaton? Stand clear of the gate. This is quite a place they have here. Got a guard posted. At least he ain't trying to shoot at me. I don't have to feel bad about interrupting that robot. Pardon me. Pardon me. Ah, fellow student on the path of the wasteland. Welcome to my humble caravan. Please relax, for we are in a place of safety. <laughs> safety. The type of safety that can only yeah. be ensured by an abundance of weaponry, both wicked and awesome, all of which can be yours for the right price. Hmm. Well, I'd like to know where I am. Maybe you could tell me about your trade caravan, where you travel to. See, the world's a dangerous and unbalanced place. So I realized the only way to bring peace was to make sure that everyone could be dangerous. So, with a little bit of help from the mayor of Canterbury Commons, I set up this caravan. I can't give the weapons away for free, but I come close. Canterbury Commons? Until the capital. Again, keep yourself alive out there. Mm. Thank you so much, sir. I'm thinking that uh, we're somewhere on the East Coast. Canterbury Commons, the capital. We might be in Washington, D.C., but I can't be rightly sure. Because I have a lapse in memory from when that UFO picked me up to when it dropped me off. And I also got uh, quite a few dangerous weapons. Let's see what I got here. Adapted biogel, alien squid food. Oh my, there were certainly aliens on that on that ship. I think that little girl might be an alien. And uh, they were goodly enough to strap me into a spacesuit. So I do appreciate that. Let's see what I got as far as weapons. It is alien disintegrator, alien atomizer. My goodness. I'll try out this too handy. We'll see how it do. That is a weird looking thing, I'll tell you what. And no iron sights on it neither. Well, old Brandon will do what he can with it. I wasn't doing too hot with my uh, mechanical weapons back in New Vegas. So maybe this will, will do me a little bit better. At least one could hope. I don't know much about the the East Coast. Seen a little bit in some picture books. But other than that, it's a whole new adventure, friends. I don't think I'll find any of my family out this way. Most of us come from Texas, Kansas, Oklahoma. Some people California. Stuff like that. But this place looks like it got hit much harder than New Vegas. Especially because uh, most of the roads out there are flat. And they got gigantic structures out this way. Big old freeways, I guess it was. Why are you going to build a freeway up? That seems dangerous for exactly the reason that uh, that is demonstrated here. Well, looks just about as dead as New Vegas. I'm hoping I can find somebody to confirm or deny my location. Maybe we can find somebody at this army truck. Hello there? Uh-oh. That's, uh... an aggressive-looking robot. Yep, yep, yep. 
can't have none of that. Oh, he is shooting napalm at a surprising rate. Let's take our shots. Oh my. Oh my goodness. And we got a little distracted there. Let's try out some of this here bio gel. Ooh, that's good stuff. Mmm, I tell you what. Ah! Don't know if it's gonna save me from this mess here. We'll give it a try. Some sort of deformed bear. I ain't never seen nothing like this in New Vegas. My goodness. Might be a wolverine of some sort. I'll take some of this here meat. Well, we ran away from the Mr. Gutsy and into something a little more dangerous. Hey, I was trying to figure out how to reload this thing. It seems just a tap on the top will do it. Oh, and there's another one. Not looking forward to this, no sir. Hmm. See if we can hit the head. Oh yes, that is nice. Didn't even make it over here. Oh my goodness. You see that? Turned into a big old pile of ash. This is strange. And a little mole rat. I ain't seen any of any of these creatures out there in uh in New Vegas. So I think we're we're in a place that's a bit more hostile. Probably because things are packed closer together on the East Coast. Hmm. Red Rocket. I think that's a gasoline station that's popular on the East Coast. So that basically confirms it. We got picked up by that ship and dropped way away from where we wanted to be. And somehow I'm gonna find my brother but we are many steps away from where we were I might need to journey a couple thousand miles to get back to New Vegas and some friendly faces not that any of the faces over there were all that friendly I could set up start a new life out this way but uh, after what I seen I just ain't so sure Ain't so sure that's the right choice. Ain't so sure my, my family's gonna be alright. And there's a Enclave Eyebot there. Try to take out some rad scorpions. Now you might be shocked that uh, I'm kind of pleased to see the rad scorpions. Alright. And you're listening to Enclave Radio, the voice of America. The voice of America! Da 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 Well, I'm rather glad to see the... The nasties. I don't want to, uh... Not know anything about what I'm facing out here. A red scorpions, I know about them. Well, it's basically like anything else, I guess. You just start shooting at it, you'll be alright. Too bad the Enclave iBot can't tell me nothing about where we are. I think the Pit Boy is about all the information I'm gonna get. Uh oh. None of that. Hey! I ain't too bad with this here weapon. Ah, oh, Coyote! How you doing, boy? Been better, I see. <laughs> ah. I feel like a. Uh, a microwave dinner in this here spacesuit. I'm sure I'm gonna have to lose this thing before I get back to New Vegas. Maybe I could trade for some clothing. I'll have to uh, trade some of this meat. Maybe some of these weapons I got on me. I picked up a lot of alien weapons, which makes me think that I was in that ship for a longer time than I had suspected. Oh my. Super mutant. He's out there. Go on, get him, doggy. I'll help you out. Oh, he's got a friend. How's that? Having a good time? No problem. 
These alien weapons, they do pack a punch. And it seems like a, a few people out here are using them. So maybe, just maybe, the aliens are more prevalent. They set up out here, started snatching people up. That's just theory, of course. But I'm glad that dog was able to help me with that there super mutant. I think he did get him. But I got them both. Took them all down. Now I'm kind of curious as to what's over here. Oh, there's a fellow with a rocket launcher posted out on watch. That don't seem too promising to me. Oh my. There's a Protectron. How you doing, Bo? Good, huh? Glad to hear it. See if I can pick up some more energy weapon. I'll take that there. Ah, looky here. Oh, Brandon's coming up in the world. Let me tell you something, boy. Hmm. I'll take some uh, lead belly. I know I'm going to be getting irradiated from just about all the food out here. Same as it was in Vegas. I guess no place was safe after all. Another Yagwai. I'm not a fan. We should be able to take him right out. Just like this one here. They're a lot tougher when they get up on you. If you can catch them from a distance, they ain't so bad. Oh, but they did murder these Brahmin. Mm-mm-mm. Now, who would leave their Brahmin just hanging out in the wastes? Think that it's gonna be okay. You got raiders. You got coyotes. Well, I guess it's wild dogs out here. It's coyotes back in the west. Are we gonna make it back to the west? I guarantee you that. Either that or die trying. Another iBot. Can't tell me nothing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Another super mutant. How's that? And done. Got him from quite a distance, I tell you what. How about you, fella? You doing all right? Fleeing. And that little thing over there? I done took out three of them already. There's number four. Ooh. Give this thing a little tappy tap to reload. Mm-hmm. I like that a lot. Oh my. Oh, damn it. Oh, damn it. Oh. Oh. Shit. Damn. Have to take out some of this here bio gel, maybe. Yeah, we got some uh, stim packs. Ah, damn. That smart's going in, but it feels good seconds afterwards. That's some more of this bio gel, and that'll about do it. But I'm feeling right as rain. Tell you what. Ah, I didn't think it would be so dangerous out here. Better keep my weapon at the ready. Now, I'm not fool enough to think that my family came all the way out here. But I'm thinking, just maybe, I could find some help. If I could find a, a small business that don't seem too aggressive. Hey, done and done. They took out that mole rat for me. I do appreciate that quite a bit. Maybe he's got friends lurking around. Hmm. I'm quite unsure. At this juncture. Just gotta keep moving. Get to the southwest. You boys like Mexico? I'm not particularly fond of it, but... The water's just as bad here as it is there. And that's the damn truth. Uh, we got some 
Some unfriendly fellows up this way. What y'all working on? Protectron? Looks like a robo brain. Well, we're gonna go ahead and save that robo brain. He a good boy. He didn't do nothing. One for you. That's right. <laughs> Piece of cake, I tell you what. Yep, those are Talon Company Merc boys. You could tell from the emblem on their chest before I blew them to bits. How you doing, Robo Brain? Just fine? Hello, sir. Hello. Glad I could save you. Assault rifle. Hmm. Not much for me here, you want me to be real honest. Hmm. Maybe we could stop in just this way. Red rocket again. What is this? Some sort of automotive garage, I would reckon. Smith Casey's. Well, my brother's name's Sun Mantha. And I figure that's similar. Maybe he. Maybe he took up in here. I guess I should be careful. I don't hear nothing through the door, but you never can tell. See? Just like that there. Gotta watch out for the nasties. All the creepy crawlies around here. Ah, Nuka Colas. Don't mind if I do. And a mole rat. Sneaking around. He a bad boy. Are you coming over this way? He sure is. Take him right down. Son Mantha! You in here, boy? Your brother Brandon come to rescue you! Just like the old days, y'all remember that? Well, I hope you do, because I don't remember much of nothing. Hmm. It does seem like an auto garage, but it doesn't seem like they're too keen on working, huh? <laughs> Got this car all mounted up on cinder blocks. That's just some madness. Ah, gun cabinet. That's quite nice. Don't mind if I do? Ah, and uh, first aid as well? That's quite thoughtful. I could use all of this, y'all. I hear something. Squealing around and the walls are under the floorboards So it leads me to believe that there might be more to this place Hmm that ain't gonna do nothing but seal it up a little further. How about this here? Yes, sir We still got a mole rat waiting for us down there. Oh Seems like he found his brother I'm still looking for mine. Son Mantha! You down here, boy? Hmm. Now, this gives me a queasy feeling. It's just like the P the BOS bunker. I want to call it the POS bunker because the piece of shit did take me up into a spaceship. Or maybe I got sold to the aliens. Or something. It's hard to know for sure. What the hell is all this? Looks like a ship. Maybe it's one of those vaults I heard about. Sure enough, look at that there. Now my family never had enough money to get into the vault. And it seems like the time for vaults has really passed. The bombs are done dropping. But I'm thinking maybe Sun Mantha in here somewhere. Thought he could hide out just a little bit. And if I find my brother, we could both head back to Mom and Pa. Whoa-ho! Look at that there. That is some type of security, I tell you what. Value for money. Mm-hmm. Now, I don't know how anyone would get in here. Unless they wanted you in here. Which, again, makes me a little suspicious that I'm going to end up back on a spaceship. Hmm, doesn't seem like nothing in here. Interesting. Well, 
I guess we're heavily armed enough to face anything that comes our way. Might as well head in just a little further. These doors keep opening. And I know Sun Mantha the type just to go exploring. And we always shut the doors behind us. That's something that we got taught from Mom and Pa. You don't want to be heating the whole world. Air conditioning the whole world. Whatever type of climate control you got in here. Oh my. According to sensors, you have arrived 202.3 years behind schedule. Yeah, I hope that's alright. Please redress in your Vault Tech issued Vault Suit before proceeding. If you have misplaced your suit, I am authorized to distribute a new one. Oh, would you Once be so kind? Dressed, please proceed down the stairs to the main floor so that you may enter your assigned Tranquility Lounger. Tranquility Lounger? Well, that sounds pretty nice to me. Let's see. What we got as far as apparel? All right, that's pretty comfy. Let's uh get rid of some of this excess weight I got on me here. There we go. Tranquility lounger, they say. Well, that does sound like something Sun Mantha would be into. Something Brandon's gonna be into. I'll tell you what. If it's as tranquil as it sounds. Might be a might better than running around in the waste, scrounging for food and water, killing yawguys and bloat flies and coyotes. Atrium, I guess that's the main lounge, huh? Oh wow, look at all these eggs! Happy Easter, everyone! Well, let's uh, see if I can just hop down here. Huh? Yeah, that ain't too bad. I'm still nice and agile. Henderson. Dithers. Unoccupied. I guess that's me. Rockwell, Rockwell. Nest bomb. Another nest bomb. Another nest bomb. We got a whole family of nest bombs in here. Foster. Unoccupied. Simpson. Henderson. Unknown. Now I think the unknown ones might be Sun Mantha. Nah. He's a mite too light. Mm mm. That ain't my boy. Unoccupied. It's broken. That's why it's unoccupied. Where's that other unknown fella? I'd like to have a look at that. Maybe it was just unoccupied. No, no, no. This one. Sun Mantha! You in here, boy? No, nope. I think that's the same fella. Well, let's see what I could do. Ain't no, uh, ain't no harm in having a little rest. Did come a long way. Oh my, that's making me a mite nervous. But all right, we'll give it a try. These robo brains should keep me nice and safe, huh? Oh boy. Uh oh. Why am I strapped in? Mistakes were made. Oh God! Ah! One, two, three, four, five,